Oh, that's a big fish. Let's try it. It kind of looks like it is. Good eye, sailor. Oh, cool. The trail ended. Good sucking, suckatron. What is this? Oh, I think we found a trail. I don't know. I've never been here. Hey, we're almost there. What? Are you struggling? Dude, this is it. Guys, we're here. Have you fished before? Get out of here. Go. Oh gosh, he knows how to, oh my gosh. He was aiming there, it went over there. What the flip is he doing? That's fine. Not everyone is Mike Tyson. <laughs> like, hold it like a man. Look at this. Hold your reel up here. Bada bing, bada bang! Sup guys, first chest mount GoPro. She ate the frigga fr frog. You know what the frog's called? It's called the frog. For a reason, because I eat it. <laughs> Bruh. Another tip about frog fishing. Usually, well for me, I set the hook rather hard. Usually, on your next cast after you set the hook, it's gonna be bird nested up. So if you can cast it to about where you think you set the hook and then pull it out, not that it'll be embedded inside your spool. So then you just pull it out, then it'll keep you from making a huge bird nest that you can't get out. Maybe I didn't let him eat that one. Oh, that's a bass. That's a, that's a black bass. Is what that is, boys. That's one of them pretty old pond hopping bass. That's what you want, right? So I know I set the hook about right there, and then I just pull that out, and then it's not bird nested in the bet. In your next cast, it's not gonna pull on your line. Not be afraid to break the rod. That's the biggest thing people were. That's, that was a bass right there. Feeding on bluegill. I'd throw right there. Dang, look at that. Oh, dude, this could be fun if we don't get kicked out of here. Feels kind of muggy today. I didn't think that was a frog. I didn't think that was a bass. Guys, I thought that was a bluegill, so I just kind of jerked it out of its mouth. She was a bass. She was a bass. Oh, sorry, dude. Sorry, dude. Mr. Beauty. I'll hold him in front of him, maybe he don't catch one. 
another tips about frog fishing. If you get hung up on a tree and you're dangling, another good, well this golfer's just going through the trees. Okay, guy. If you get caught up, don't think of it as a bad thing. Maybe pick your rod up, plop that frog. What you, you can do that maybe five to 10 times and let it sit. It'll pull those fish from a couple, couple y'all, I say couple, I really don't know exact measurements. Like I'm telling you numbers, I don't know. But it will pull them from wherever they are and they'll come up and smash it. And then you gotta, just keeps in the strike zone that much longer. Oh, that's a big fish. Hmm. Well, the rod did not hold up. But, I think I've got the fish. Got the, got the fish, boys. I got the fish. What you know about that? That sucks. Well, that broke a $300 rod. I don't know. I just set the hook. Oh man. Wowzers. Oh dude, that was a big bass in the reeds. Boys oh. Doing. How's it going down there, Neil? You should tell them. Can you shut up? I'm fishing. As we're on the golf course, let me see this. Come here. I'm not gonna go up there to catch one. Remember, when you set that hook, you rip. Somewhere else. Yeah, we could. Calling up to the club what were we in the way for? I'm not sure. They just said that you guys have been, that you guys are fishing and you guys are in the way. Okay. Yeah, man, we can bust up. Yeah, sorry about that. Yeah, for sure. Here, come throw that in. I'm gonna go grab that out of the rod. Remember, pause whenever it blows up. What? Go real, real, real fast. Real, real. Yes, reel it. Reel that son of a gun. Reel it. Reel. Rip it. Pull it up. Pull it up. Pull it up. Pull. Yes. Yes. Right before we get kicked off. Yes. Hold that bad boy. That's the biggest one. No, grab my lip. You don't have teeth. That's actually the biggest one. Come in there, mullet. <laughs> you're 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 in their way. <laughs> Sir, you're in my way. Oh, I'm so glad you freaking got him. So worth it. Make sure that's. Dude, I just had a freaking bass fall that. No fucking way. <laughs> that was frog and a Ronnie Ripper across the top of the water. What? No. No. Come in there, Ronnie. Ripper. This is literally a Texas rig that I'm skimming across the top of the water. <laughs> and that fish just came out of freaking Jupiter. Okay guys, last cast before they 
really come down here and send this away. They've already asked us pretty nicely. <laughs> no way. So we better be respectful at least. Okay, one more and then that's... Okay, never mind. This is the last cast. Promise, promise, promise. This is about how it goes with me and my wife. Last cast. 47 casts later. Okay, guys, we'll leave on a good note. Yeah, <laughs> guys, we're leaving. I promise, we're leaving. But... There's a pond right over here. There was a whole entire pond in there. What if a big old bass? How do we get the flip out of here? Let's just stay towards the grass. We'll just hug this line right here. And just jump it. <laughs> well, this was when you said, choose the right. This was the trail. False, actually. Actually, no. You're right. Over there. <laughs> I'm kind of hungry now. Want to grab something to eat? Or you got to head out? I'm going to get some sushi anyway. Gross. Dude, this was literally choose the left. Are you fetching serious? He's always, I mean, it's good to always choose the right guys, but in this situation, we should have chose the left. <laughs> hmm. Okay, guys, uh, in this video, obviously you've already seen it. Me and one of my buddies from my mission uh, met up and uh, somewhere in Ogden. <laughs> I don't even know the golf course or anywhere. We actually Google mapped it. I used to do this when I was back in Mississippi and they were a little bit more lenient. Uh, I would say lenient. They kind of, we made it about an hour, I would say, before they really got on to us and came down there and said, hey, uh, we've been getting some complaints. And uh, we had to dip out of there. Uh, fishing was good. It was his first time ever like frog fishing or really and truly bass fishing. Fishing was super good. It was super fun. It's a super, oh dude, it was a blast. It was just, it was a blast. Uh, word of advice, if you're fishing golf course ponds, call the golf course and ask them most of them are probably going to tell you no but i mean it's an easy way to get in there and they might be like yeah come at dark uh when when no one's golfing but either way it was a it was a freaking blast like uh at the end we we found the right way to get into the golf course pond where everyone else had been going but we traveled through the wilderness of Jurassic Park for 45 minutes to an hour, but hey, it was a blast. So see you. Peace out